On Friday, the Terriers hosted Northeastern in the first half of the season opening Friday night doubleheader. The Huskies jumped out to an early lead with stellar three-point shooting from Shannon Todd and Jess Janko. In the second quarter, Boston University narrowed the lead with aggressive field play from Peyton Hawk. Stadium as we watch Peyton Hawk deliver another layup. Naya Irving and a nice pick there set by Irving against Claudia Ortiz. She'll put up a quick shot and box up again. Boston University went to the locker room with a narrow 32-27 lead. The Terriers extended their lead to double digits in the third. Clutch threes by Vanessa Edgehill and Katie Nelson kept BU in the lead as the Huskies closed in late with several fast breaks. Vanessa Edgehill provides it. Fights against Nelson on the line. Janko tries to lay in the two shot and Shannon Todd finishes the job for two. In the end, a decisive block by Sophie Beaudry ended the Huskies' hopes. All the way around the rim, Stella on the rebound and Sophie stops her like the Thanksgiving turkey. And mighty quick hit. And that will do it. The Terriers hold on with a one point advantage. BU takes their season opener 74 to 73, improving to 1 and 0. They next visit UNH Wednesday, November 15th at 7 p.m. Amazing win, a one point victory, such a hard fought victory. Tell me, I know all kinds of emotions are going through your head right now. <laughs> um, I'm really proud of the group because um, uh, Northeastern's given us the business the last couple of years and we really came out. Um, I thought we handled it from start to finish. I thought we did a good job. Obviously. We we would have liked to finish in a little stronger position than a one-point game, but you got to give them credit. They have great shooters. They ran some good sets. And we were uh, lucky enough to survive them, so really happy with the group. Now, one thing I noticed is your team has a lot more swagger this season than they did last year. What do you think the difference has been? Well, we've been practicing swagger, so you know that's <laughs> helped. Um, no, I, I, you know, I think we we've given them a lot of confidence to to kind of do their thing. Uh, our offense is less restrictive than it used to be, and, and the kids are able to play a little more freely. So, you know, we've got some good players, but uh, people in the offseason made a lot of strides. So I'm just really happy that our freshmen came in and played real well, and that our uh, upperclassmen came in and really led, um, and were just really solid from start to finish. Now, speaking of your freshmen, we got a chance to see some of the future of the Terriers in both Presley and in Nelson. Outstanding games by them tonight. Can you tell us a little bit about the preparation that went into getting them ready for this game? Um, you know, I mean, they've, they've uh, Tanisha's been fighting a little bit of a sore knee all summer and stuff, and so she's only really been fully go for like a couple, three weeks. And so I was really impressed uh, with her efforts the last couple of weeks of practice when she's starting to feel pretty good. And, uh, and obviously, you know, she, she took advantage of the opportunity tonight. And Katie Nelson, just really solid kid, really solid player. She's smart, she's gritty, she is tough, she doesn't get rattled under pressure. Um, and she just did it, I thought she did a phenomenal job tonight, so I'm really happy. All right, thank you so much, Coach. I'll let you go celebrate with your team. Congratulations. Thank you.